staying calm when the shots are coming and they're making the push. Just continue with my process, continue playing for the guys in this room, continue to battle with the group we have on the ice and continue with the, just the mindset of earning it with the group on that ice that there. I mean, what ways, in what ways did your defenseman help you sort of see shots tonight? It seemed like you, yeah. you were able to sort of see the lanes a lot. They were awesome, clearing traffic. They were outstanding, making sure I could see everything, grabbing sticks. And even a lot of the backdoor plays, it, it would be surprising how much, how many times they got, got sticks in the plays to make them not really execute the shot they wanted to execute. So they did an awesome job, and I owe a lot of credit to those guys tonight. How special was it to do it in this city against this team? I guess for you. It was great, but once again, like I said before, it's just two points. It doesn't matter who we are, who we're playing against, who, what's going on. On. Doesn't matter if my family's in town or what. So going out there with these, this group of guys and just giving it all I have for this group, no matter where it is or when it is. You knew they were going to push in the third period. Did you expect 23 shots? Like if they came at you pretty early. Oh yeah, it's wherever they get, they're going to get. I mean, but once again, our decor did an awesome job of just making sure everything was to outside, everything was taken care of, and they. I mean, once again, props to them. They were awesome out there all night tonight. A lot of work has gone into this opportunity for you. How, how gratifying is it to, to have a performance like that? I mean, once again, it feels good, but it's just one game. It's go get ready for practice tomorrow and go out there and just continue to get better every single day and just uh, continue to build throughout the season. It's not, uh, it's not this is the best thing ever. And then all of a sudden get up here, just stay right here and stay with the level of emotions and get ready for practice the next day. How do you try to stay in, in that? Is it more calm, more intense? What's your... I'm, I try to stay as calm as I can and just let the play come to me and just uh, just have a lot of fun because, once again, it's, this is hockey. It's what I love doing and just to go out there and just have a blast doing it. How do you prepare for a game against a guy like with David who... I mean, not only carries the play the way he does, but shoots the way he does. I mean, he's he's a fantastic hockey player. He's one of the one of the best in the world, if not the best. Uh, but we have a lot of good hockey players in this room too. So, same thing with the good. And then they got to prepare the same way against Palmer or those guys, we guys we have on our team, because we have a lot of skill on our team. But for myself, it's just I'm playing the puck. It doesn't matter who the player is. I'm playing the puck, and that's the same. The puck's the same size. The rink's the same size. It doesn't matter who we're playing against. I'm just trying to go out there and execute my game plan. Thanks, sir. 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 Thanks,